I'm going to be doing something today that I've never done before. This is a team that I've never assembled once in my, my existence. A lot of the builds that I've done already, I have done before either in MLB 18 or just at some point in time in the history of this channel's existence. But this one is as new as the berry flavored Pepsi that's going to be in grocery stores, I think, very soon because I saw it in a flyer or something yesterday. I don't think that's gonna be good. What is on the screen right now is players who have gotten into fights. Now, not every single player in this lineup is somebody who has escalated or started a brawl. At the least, if they haven't been the two involved people in the brawls, they were also included or just on the field in the scrum when the brawl was taking place. But if I'm not mistaken, every single player in this starting lineup right now has been in a very large brawl and they may have been the few people who started it. So behind the plate this game is Gary Sanchez. Now I think the one, the one that stood out to me was the one they got into with the Tigers. If I'm not mistaken, Miggy of all people was on the ground and Gary Sanchez was getting the little feeds into him. What is that? So he definitely likes to mix it up. Josh Donaldson is at third base this game. If the Blue Jays and the Rangers didn't have some damn tilts, I don't know who has. Josh Donaldson may have came running out of the dugout like an insane person during that Rugned, Odor, and Bautista fight, and he may have speared Odor edge style. So he's at third base, and he might not even throw fist of cups. He might just spear people. So that might be even more lethal. Manny Machado is at short this game. He may have been involved in a couple, if I'm not mistaken. Some of the things he was involved in didn't even involve fists being thrown. It was more stepping on the back of people's feet. So he definitely likes to, uh... Step on the back of people's feet. Rugnet Odor may have thrown the best punch I've ever seen. He connected with Jose Bautista's left jaw. Everybody's jaw was on the ground. He is probably the number one person who should be on this list. He got into a couple, I'm pretty sure, too, but that is the most memorable. Mem- Memor- What? I don't know what I just said. The most memorable one. That was probably one of the best brawls that I've seen personally in the last, like, decade. It has nothing to do with me being a Blue Jays fan either. I show zero favoritism on this gym. Nolan Arenado, man, I may have been scared when I saw Arenado charging the mound because it doesn't seem like he would be the one to do so, so he must have been furious when he did. Dude, he came running out to the mound and he was a man on a mission looking for somebody's skull. Long story short, don't piss off Arenado or he will make a beeline to the mound. This guy. Jose Bautista might be the number one person to ignite a fight. This guy is always causing shit for the most part. How many times has Bautista been on the field when something has escalated? Corey Hunt, he was involved in one with uh, Pudge, I believe. He actually punched Pudge right in the chest. I'm not mistaken. Huh? What was that? So he's in center field this game and Bryce Harper's in left. Dan, he may be up there with Odor for the one who can throw some punches. Not sure if him and Strickland had a, a, had a fight on the mound or a, 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 a hardcore title belt fight. So he's in left this game. The bench before I forget because I think I have in the last two builds I've done. Astrubal Cabrera. I didn't even know that he was even involved in a fight until I was watching some last night. And all you, honestly, all you could see was Cabrera just like jumping up and down trying to break it up. Actually, I don't even know if he was trying to break it up. He could have been trying to throw some hands. So either way, he's, he's in there. Carlos Gomez, I was very tempted on putting him in center this game or, over Hunter because, man, how many times has this guy been in something? Lorenzo Kane has mixed it up a couple of times with Chicago, if I'm not mistaken. There's a couple players on this team in that exact brawl. Yasiel Puig might be one of those guys who's always involved in something, too. He might be better at throwing slaps. Miguel Sano, he, he pulled one of those, you know, he looked at the catcher and boom. He fed him. So this is where things get a little bit interesting because not every single player has been involved in a fight, but most of them have. And if they haven't, they've been at least in the mix. Zach Granke, dude, you know what? 
I don't know who I said was the number one person who should be on this list, but Granky might be up there as well. Chris Sale was jumping around like a nut during the Chicago White Sox and Kansas City Royals brawl in 2016. Garrett Cole was one of the players involved with Carlos Gomez when he was rounding the bases. He was he was the one chirping at him. I'm surprised no punches were thrown, but he definitely is willing to mix it up at least. Rick Porcello, I feel bad for this fucking guy. This guy was charged by the, or charged by Kevin Euclid, and he didn't even want any part of it. Actually, he was the one who tackled Euclid to the ground. Severino, the only one I've seen him involved in was the one with the Jays, where I think he plunked somebody and then the bench is cleared. I don't think he was throwing any haymakers or anything like that, but he was definitely involved in the melee. Hunter Strickland. Bryce Harper's worst enemy is in the bullpen. He's the number one reliever. Joe Kelly. Dude, this guy. They sell shirts that say Joe Kelly Fight Club on them. Jeff Samarja. Remember when he and Volquez, I think it was, were legitimately throwing hands. I don't think anyone connected with anything, but he was involved in that. Elvin Herrera was involved in some of those Royals brawls as well, if I'm not mistaken, so he's also there. Ken Giles doesn't brawl with anybody besides his own forehead. Matt Bush is uh, still not in the good books of Toronto Blue Jays fans to this day. And I remember that exact day I'm talking about. And Sam Dyson, how many players from the Rangers are on this damn list? He's also there too. I think I, I think I covered everyone, didn't I? This is the squad. This team isn't so bad as the last one. The last one only had like one diamond on the team. So realistically, with my skill level, a chance in the shit of the fuck is what I didn't stand a chance in. So at least this time, I have a chance of doing something. All right, nice. This guy's from Toronto, so I'm hoping the connection is an absolute garbage. Wow, nice as well. He has a lefty on the mound. Everybody besides Odor and Harper are righties. All right. Oh, wait a minute. Did they change Liriano's delivery? Jesus Christ, Arenado hits everything hard, man. I don't know if this guy has ever hit anything not a million miles per hour. What difficulty this is on? What the hell? This looks like it's on damn... Hide in the corner and cry mode like I always go on about. He's just on five fastballs. Except for that one. Curl five until then. That's absolutely destroyed! Jesus! Kinsler? Fuck, I wonder if Kinsler is yelling, fuck those fans running around the bases. Holy shit, the bat! Where did it even go? Where did that bat land? I walk in with, man, I don't like putting the time or the go ahead run on the damn played in this game. Anything. You know, if I walk this son of a bitch, what is going to happen next? Probably a three-run shot. That is a clutch-ass pitch, and I would have made myself look like an idiot if I if he scored a run. I don't know why I even throw it! How is he fouling so many bitches off? Thank the fucking lord! It's been the longest first inning in history. Hold on, calm down, buddy. Dude, this Odor absolutely destroys baseballs. Yeah, I probably would have been out. That's absolutely crushed. It's going to the same place Bautista hit it. What is happening? How is this happening? Is the bigger question. This guy! Oh, jeez. Actually, that's fine. Never mind. It's unfortunate I have to face Bumgarner, but it's good that it's a lefty. Granky's on the mound. That's good. Stubby Chubby is his Diamond Dynasty player's name. Why do I feel like his Diamond Dynasty player is going to look like an ogre or something if his name is that? We'll see, though. It's going to look like Shrek with a mullet. Oh, I was getting excited for a second again. Oh, boy. Yep, I need to remember. A cutter is what I'm probably going to see the most. Arenado again hit something hard, but right at the left fielder again. Oh, jeez. That's exactly the way you don't want to start a game. Here you go. There's a fucking hanging curveball in a fucking McDonald's tray. That was a beautiful 
bitch. He's gonna run this out, though. Oh, no, he's not. Nice play. Granky going to be the beast. Uh-oh. He was in MLB 18. Jesus. He went upstairs. Oh, I went upstairs, and oh, here we go. What does he look like? It's like Paul Heyman. Jesus, that's like multiple times the bat has been helicoptering in the infield. Throw into the $12 beers. Get through. Move! Run your fucking ass. Thought for sure he was going to call that a swing. Nope, didn't buy it that. I actually meant to swing at the last one, not that one though. He's got to establish that pitch in. Oh, that's unfortunate. Wait a minute, that one that was an error? Interesting. And I don't swing at that. That's the exact pitch I've been destroying so far today. Bah! Jesus Christ, look at that curveball. Get this below the zone, this will work. If it's where it's supposed to be. Look at that! What? He swung at that? Nice, nice pitch, asshole. Don't do it again. Granky! Dude, Granky is the best hitter on the team. I'm serious. Let's get down! Go! Can you believe it? Granky started this? Dude! Get out of here! I thought I missed that. I was kind of confused as to how that left. What? Jesus, this is a pitcher's duel right now. Like, we are both fucking striking out like animals. Jesus Christ, we're like swing. The, the, the wind from the swings right now is gonna knock somebody over. Both of us. I'm, yeah, I need to focus here. I'm fucking swinging and missing too much. I was just saying I was on everything. Yikes. I thought I was gonna come back and find the zone. Oh, we booted it. Okay. Odor! Or Odor! I don't know how I did that. How did I poke that to left? Donaldson. Jesus. Manny! Ah! Frankie's gonna catch in a run, I guarantee it. I guarantee it! No, I I would have been I wouldn't even halfway down the line. That somehow finds a hole too! I have no idea how that happened! Keep scoring! I feel like this is gonna be a fail if I don't keep scoring. And Arenado delivers! They're both jogging to it. What? The floodgates have opened up and they are locked open at this point. What is happening? I should have been waiting for that. Go up the gut. Ah. Well, how about that inning? Good one. Jesus, he was waiting for that. Should have threw a curveball. Batista. Hurry, Bautista! Yeah, he was late on that one, but he's been on almost every single fastball so far. I don't know why I keep throwing them, but... Well, he was on that. He was on that like the chocolate coating is stuck to my Tim Hortons bag when I buy a donut. If you're from Canada, you probably know exactly what I'm talking about. Oh no. Okay, good. I don't know if I should even throw that again. I'm scared to throw a curveball at this point, because Sanchez might drop it. Jesus, he crossed that one. Get out of here. Something has taken over my body and is dancing with it. He said, screw Bumgarner. You know what? I, my ass would have taken him out when it was like three nothing. That might leave too. What the fuck game is this? This is 18 maybe. Many hits one. Right. Everybody, everything that's put, been put in play so far has a vapor trail coming off. Wow. 
It's about time they get something going. Oh, that could have been ugly. Swing and miss on the breaking. Oh, yeah. Is Greggy even fair to use at this point? I mean, the guy is hitting the fucking... Oh, look at this guy. What is happening? He gets a base hit every single time he comes to the plate. He has the dirtiest curveball I've ever seen. Dude, look at fucking Greggy. That might get down again. That was very close to. That's a pitch I never expected to see. A break or a, a high slider. Which you've been hitting to my aunt's stairwell. Unfortunately, that's why this guy's been able to I wasn't ready for it. If Granky continues to be, and oh, he did. Be ready for something inside. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. Oh, he's gonna get him. How does Gary have a gold shield? That just that if anything doesn't make sense in this game, it's that. Well, oh, look at that read. I should have threw it right to second. Swing was as beautiful as a wild skunk in the wild. Or a skunk in the wild, I said wild twice in one sentence. But that was a crushing of a crush. That might leave. No. Who did he even put in? Bautista missed me. He almost sent one deep again. What's going on outside? It sounds like there's a damn... Optimus Prime is outside my house right now. It's like a big loud truck. What is going on? Listen, if anybody doesn't want to have an 8-0 lead, it's me. Nobody chokes 8-0 leads better than this guy sitting in this chair right now. Holy shit, that was supposed to be way lower. Granky is unstoppable. He's dealing on the hill. He's dealing strawberry muffins on the hill right now is how many, or how much he's dealing. Look at this. I thought there's going to be a huge inning for some reason. I should have been ready. Oh, it lands anyway. What the fuck? How does that make sense? If that left, I would have shit out of my ears. Frankie, it's time to hit a home run, buddy. This is exactly what's happening. Dude, I'm serious. Oh, he's gonna get thrown out. Never mind. Granky is unfair. What is going on? The hits are raining down on the stadium at this point. Everybody and their damn stepbrother has a fucking Johnny Venter's gold version. I'm serious. That got through somehow. This is just a shit show at this point. I have no idea how this is happening. I have no idea how I'm doing this, but apparently the team put up 10 runs and I have no idea what how it happened. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> well, uh... There's that. I think the only way you can stop Granky right now is if a paddy wagon comes on the field and you throw him in the back of it. In a cage. Uh-oh. Look at Donaldson. I know he's, you know, it was an out, but this guy is killing everything. Oh, Granky's getting another at bat. Look at him. He's three for four for fuck's sake. I'm gonna fucking throw up. Oh, I thought that was getting down 100%. That was just, I literally, the words were coming out of my mouth. I bet he goes crazy in the ninth inning. Let me have erased that. I am in absolute shock right now. I'm even locating outside sliders, even though we got a hit out of it. Should be it. If Granky doesn't get player of the game, there's going to be a riot. Huh? That doesn't make any sense to me. The amount of sense that makes could be thrown in a well. I think it's safe to say the team that brawls is uh, 
quite impressive. I may have to bring this team back and ASAP if they're going to play like this. If I can play like this every game... <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'll probably shit the bed the next game.